Hello, students. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. Hi, how are you? Hi. Very well. Okay, I am very happy that you are doing great. Okay, I am, let me see, I'm going to check that everybody's connected. Let me see, welcome Anna, welcome David, welcome Mr. Elmer, Mr. Eduardo, Noemi, Jenny, Elena, welcome to your class. It is a pleasure to be here with you and welcome to beginner three. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Is this your first time in the program or you have previous uh, previous knowledge of the language? ¿Es su primera vez con nosotros o ya han estado con nosotros antes? Ya hemos estado con ustedes antes, teacher. Yeah, yeah, I have some, I have some of my students here. Me he vuelto a encontrar con uno que otro aquí nuevo. Ah, de nuevo. <laughs> it's a pleasure to see you again. Okay. Well, you see, life takes us back. So we're going to wait for, uh, to see if many of your friends are going to connect, okay? Well, in general, I hope that you are doing well. Welcome to your new level. Welcome to your new course, right? This is pre-intermediate three, pre-intermediate, beginner three. Ya los, ya los llevo para allá para pre-intermediate. Yeah. This is a beginner three. Well, this is me. This is going to be your teacher, right? Uh, I am Evelyn Natalie Monterrosa. I am your teacher. I am a, a licenciada en idioma inglés. Opción enseñanza. I, for sure, I have a licenciatura en idiomas. En, tengo diferentes diplomados en diferentes metodologías de enseñanza, cursos de didáctica, pedagogía, planificación, etc. Obviamente todos aquí somos English experts y para allá vamos todos también para convertirnos en ese English expert que buscamos. Y pues obviamente mi experiencia laboral, eh, he sido docente ya por buen rato en mi vida, casi 19 años, en diferentes universidades, eh, academias, institutos, eh, fui intérprete también de una fundación y obviamente trabajé 10 años en el programa empresarial Superate como docente de inglés, trabajo en Regal International aquí con inglés corporativo y también en una academia que se llama English Learning Center en San Salvador, esa es mi trayectoria docente y pues estoy aquí para servirles en este nuevo curso que hoy iniciamos. For sure, the course is going to be in English, right? So we are going to practice English. So tell me in brief, we're going to check a little bit in brief, uh, who you are and one important thing about you. Todos ustedes, you are going to tell me who you are and one important thing about you. Go ahead. We're going to start with Carlos. Una cosa importante acerca de Carlos, para que todos lo conozcamos. Mr. Carlos Regalado, go ahead. Ok. Algo importante. Ajá. Uh -huh. One important thing about Carlos. Marco. Ajá. Marco. Sorry, I, I didn't get it. Trabajo. Uh -huh. It can be your work. It can be something that you do, something that you like, okay. algo que te guste. No sé, algo que tú consideres importante. Que okay. todos sepamos. Go ahead. I drive. You drive. Drive. Uh -huh. Okay. Drive. Good. For a specific place, for Uber or something uh, like that, no? Car. A drive car. Okay, you drive cars. Good, very good. What about Mr. Julio Ortiz? Tell me one important thing about you. Um, mi trabajo, teacher. 
Uh -huh. My work. Okay, your work. Where do you work? Donde trabaja? Um, in aduana, uh, the customs. Okay, in customs. Very good, very good. Let me see. One important thing about, uh, let me see. Ana. Uh, good evening, everyone. Hello, Hello good evening. Uh, my name is Anna, and um, in this moment, I don't work, but I like learn English. You like to learn English. Very good. Mr. David Morales, one important thing about you. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. It's, it's important to read it in the book. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, Mr. Elmer, one important thing about you. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. Uh, for me, the important is the work. Okay, your work. Where do you work? I work in Ministerio de Hacienda. Oh, okay, you work in Ministerio de Hacienda. Mr. Eduardo Romero, one important thing about you. Uh, good night. My name is Eduardo Romero. I job in Ministerio de Hacienda. Okay. And I am friendly and I like to I am like to exercise. Oh, you like to exercise. Very good. Thank you very much. Let's continue with Miss uh, Jenny. Good evening. Hi, good evening. Uh, I am accounting. Okay, you are an accountant, good. Accountant, and I like dance. You like to dance, hey, that's fantastic, very good. Let's go with Noemi. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. My name is Noemi. Um, my family is important. Your family is the important part for you. Very, very nice. Let's see, Daisy Perez. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. Um, I like to learn and read. Okay, you like to learn and read. Read. Read, very good. Real. Thank you very much. Ingris. One important thing about you. Good night. Hello, good evening. My name is Ingrid. I like a life of sorry i couldn't listen a life oh, okay creo que en inglés tenemos un problemita ahí con el audio no le pudimos escuchar si no me lo manda al chat y todos lo leemos let's go with evelyn one important thing about you, Evelyn. Hola, buenas noches. Hello, good evening. Eh, bueno, mi nombre, my name is Susan Sahet. Okay. Um, I like is a... Um, eh, leer. I like to read, right? I like to read, you say. Y este, solo quería comentarle que en este momento me encuentro eh, mal de salud. Oh. Solo quería comentarle para, por la ausencia de, de ese día dentro de la clase. Ok, don't worry. Es importante igual que, nos, que me comenten cualquier dificultad que tengamos para yo también no estarles ahí fregando, que me hablen y hablen y hablen. <laughs> ok, but that's good. Thank you, Susana. Now I know. Now I know. Very good. Very good. Thank you, Susan. Let's see. Let's continue with Elena. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Hi, good evening. Um, um, I'm a psychology student. Um, um, only <laughs> but that, that's important that's very important you are a psychology student very good you are a student very nice let's continue with janita 
Tell me something important about you, Jenny. Good evening, teacher. Hi, uh, good evening. Uh, one thing very important in my life is um, learn, it's learn, too learn uh, always new, new things. Very good, to Thank learn you. new things. That's fantastic. Yes. It is very important to learn I new things. Cats. Hey, you like the cats. That's good. Yes. <laughs> That's fantastic. Me too. Let's see. Heidi, tell me something important about you. Hello, teacher. Good, good. evening. Good evening. Good evening. Pardon. Good evening. I, I very important in my life is my family. Your family. Very good. Wilfredo, tell me something important for you. Uh, good evening. Hi, good evening. Uh, um, my important with my my life is the health. Okay. Um, I like uh, I like uh, work to the morning. Okay, you like to work in the morning. That that's it. <laughs> okay, good, very good. Let's continue with, let me see, who am I missing? Who am I missing? Quien se me queda? Say me, if I'm missing you. I have, I, I have Wilfredo, Evelyn, Yanira, Carlos, Eduardo, Jenny, Julio, yes. Flor de Maria, go ahead. Okay, Flor de Maria, I cannot listen to you. Try now. <clears throat> no, okay. Flor de Maria says that she uh, her microphone doesn't work. Well, uh, I don't know if I am missing someone. Se me queda alguien. No se me queden sin participar, dígame yo, 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 yo. César. César Montesino en Abigail. Go ahead. César. Good evening, teacher. Uh, Good evening. My life is reading. Um, uh, working. Okay, reading, working. And um, my import, my import, my love in family. Um, my student. Okay. Ah, oh, you're a teacher. <laughs> um, Are you a teacher, uh, Cesar? I don't know. No, no, no. Uh, I am an economist. Oh, you I are an economist. Okay, good. I work in Ministerio de Hacienda. Okay, good. Very good. Okay, excellent. And Miss Abigail, go ahead. Good evening. Hi, good evening. Uh, well, my family is very important for me and also my pets and my plants. Okay, your pets and your plants. Plants are very important, okay? Don't let them die. Yeah. <laughs> Don't let them die because mm -hmm. that's that's horrible when they die. Well, my dear students, uh, it is very nice that I get to know you a little bit uh, better, right? I get to know you a little bit more in every single class. So. Welcome everybody now that we have listened a little bit about everybody. We are going to continue with the class. Important things that we are going to work on, okay? I really like to have this type of agreements in all the classes. Me gusta que todos estemos en el mismo track, pero que también sigamos una serie de acuerdos, okay? The agreements. Can you help me to read the number one? Everybody, can you help me to read number one? Me. Go ahead. Have to use English as as much as pos possible. Okay, everybody, everybody, everybody. I need to listen to everybody. Number one. Practice, 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 practice as as much as possible. As much as possible. As practice your English as much as possible. Why? Because this is the only moment that we have to practice, right? 
We don't have time to practice during the day. Or do you? ¿Tienen oportunidad de practicar durante el día? Yes or no? No, no right? No, we don't. no, so take advantage. Take advantage of this time, okay? I know that here in El Salvador, we don't speak English, right? And it is difficult because we need to practice. But in class, I am going to do my best to speak only in English, okay? I know it's kind of difficult that you are going to say like, oh, the teacher no me habla en español. But it's the idea because the class is in English and we are learning English. I am going to do my best to help you understand everything, okay? And if you don't understand, teacher, I need help. Teacher, I have a question. Teacher, repeat. Okay? Si tenemos, si necesitamos ayuda. Teacher, help me. Teacher, repeat. Teacher, I don't understand. Ask for help. Okay? Ask for help when needed. Ask for help when needed. If you get stuck in the middle of the language, ask for help. Okay? Pidan ayuda. If you need help, ask for help. But right now, not at the end of the, of the module, right? No, ya por marzo 22. Teacher, fíjese que no entendí la primera clase. No, in the first class. I mean, ask for help if you need. Then number three, keep your cameras on all the time. Can you help me to read this one? Keep your cameras on all the time. Keep your Keep cameras, your cameras on, on all the time. Why? Because we are in the virtual world and this makes us feel closer. Cuando encendemos la cámara, nos sentimos más cerca de nuestros compañeros, aunque vivan en la Unión, en Santa Ana, en Chalatenango, en Sonsonate, en Guatemala, I don't know. But if you have the camera and I can see you, I can see you speaking, I can see you producing, I can see you reading. It is better, right? I really appreciate that you open your house for me, okay? Yo les agradezco que abran este espacio de su casa para mí, para esta clase. No estamos aquí para criticar el espacio de nadie, porque es el lugar donde nos permiten entrar. Y ese lugar sí es bien valioso, porque ahí se está dando el aprendizaje. Así que no me diga, ay, dicha, es que aquí está como raíz. No importa. No importa. Porque lo importante es usted su carita y toda hermosa. That's the important thing about the class. So keep your cameras on all the time. The next one, number four, keep the microphones off if you are not using it, okay? If we are not using the microphone, keep it off. If not, we're going to listen there to uh, the dog, the cat, the bread, everything, right? If you are not using the microphone, keep it off. Si no lo estamos usando el micrófono, lo apagamos. Okay? okay? Cuando le diga yo, everybody open the microphone and then we participate, okay? The next one, okay. number five, it's very important. Attend all your sessions on time because the sessions are important, right? The classes, the practice, the interaction is important. Number six, can you help me to read? Number six, read number six. Participate as much as, as possible. Participate as much as possible, right? Si me equivoco, it's okay. I no lo leí bien, it's okay. Ay, me da pena, it's okay, right? Participate, it's important. Que, que lo voy a poder hacer mal, que no sé qué, que lea otro. No, las oportunidades no se dejan ir. Participate, whenever you have the chance, participate. Number seven, keep a cooperative attitude during class. And number eight, collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. The WhatsApp group, it's for you to interact, okay? For you to practice your English, for you to do your homework, for you to communicate. So please collaborate with your friends on the WhatsApp group. It is important, okay? Si recibimos algún comunicado en el grupo de WhatsApp, entendido, muchas gracias. Eh, la información ha sido recibida. Answer, please. Hoy saludé a todo el grupo y nadie me saludó. And I was like, mm. 
I was very sad. So work on the group and the homework on the group, right? I am going to assign homework. Yo sí les dejo tareas, así que ah, les voy a dejar tareas en el grupo, así que vamos a poner las pilas. Ahí. Ahora me, ay, hola teacher en el grupo. Ah, come on, come on. Okay, so please include yourself in the group. Okay, include yourself in the, in the group and participate. Any question? No teacher. No teacher. ¿Algún, and... ¿Algún otro agreement que quieran poner? No. No, no teacher. That's okay. All of them are okay? ¿Sellamos mm. el pacto de los acuerdos? Mm. Yes. 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 Eh, okay. um, una cuestión. Ajá. <laughs> uh -huh. eh, eh, para ingresar al grupo, ¿dónde está el...? Ah, in the email. In the email oh, that you okay. receive, there is okay. the link for you to click on the link and then you enter to the group, okay? Excellent, thank you. Thank you, thank you very much. Okay, so that's the, those are the agreements. Let's follow the agreements. And I can see all the beautiful cameras on. I can see your faces now. That's very beautiful. Thank you. I am not, I am just missing Elena, eh, Janira, Abigail, y David, and Josue Alexander. But for the rest, I can see you very well. Fantastic. Let's continue now. The next part that I want to show you right here is the calendar of activities. We are going to have different activities and we have the platform as well. Creo que todos ya entraron a la plataforma. Sí? No? Me equivoco? No? Okay. So if you haven't entered. No, teacher. Okay. If you haven't entered, the link is on your email. Okay. The link is on your email. And we are going to have four weeks together, right? We're going to be together for four weeks. So here we have the advancement that you need to have in the platform, okay? Este es el avance sugerido. Se lo pueden enviar igual a WhatsApp. No se preocupen por anotarlo ahorita. Yo se los envío a WhatsApp. It says, week number one, we need to complete sections one and two of the platform. On week number two, section three and the exams, on week number three, sections four and five. And on week number four, the final evaluations, okay? We are going to be together for 16 days. That it's four weeks, okay? So this is the process that we are going to follow for the different advancements that we are going to have in the platform, okay? So uh, keep it in mind because you are going to be working on this during the process of the of the module okay so be very careful with this section uh i really know that you have studied the platform before but let's just go over it so this is your curse this is what you are going to find in the platform eso es lo que se van a encontrar en la plataforma para muchos de ustedes ya no es nuevo hay alguno de ustedes que es su primera vez aquí no? Sí. Who? No. No? Yes. Okay, who, who, who? Ingris, it's your first time. Good okay. morning. Hi, hi Ingris, good evening. ¿Es su primera vez? ¿Es su primera vez en inglés corporativo? Sí. Okay, en inglés corporativo recibe un correo donde le dan un acceso a la plataforma. No sé si ya tuvo, ya tuvo acceso a ese correo. Sí, ya puedo ingresar y eh, automáticamente ellos me, me redigieron al módulo. Ok, perfecto. So, I am going to show you the exercises. Every section, in every section you have different exercises and you have different evaluations, right? These are the different things that you need to do, ok? All these evaluations, todos los que tienen el lapicito son evaluaciones. So, esos son prácticas y refuerzos y lo de lapicitos son las evaluaciones. So, you need to work on the evaluations. It is important that you do it, okay? So, eh, every section has around three evaluations. So, please make sure that you work on them. And if you have any questions on an evaluation, let me know, okay? Si de repente nos trabamos en alguna cosa de la plataforma, eh, hay que mandarlo al chat in WhatsApp, y ahí nos ayudamos entre todos, okay? So, Ingris, this is the platform, right? And 
this is basically it. You need to work on the different sections for you to improve and for you to practice. Important at the end of the module, you need to have more than 80% for you to pass to the next level, okay? Arriba de 80%, pero todos mis estudiantes salen con 100%, así que 100%. That's like the minimum that I ask for. So this is the platform. Well, let's continue then. We got to know the platform a little bit and we are going to keep on working on today's class. Can you tell me what month are we in? What month are we in right now? What is the month that we are right now? February. February, February, February. good. And the past month? January. 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 What is the next one? March. 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 And after March? April. 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 And after April? May. 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 Okay. May or May? May. 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 My name, right? After May? June. June. July. Then? August. 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 September. September, the most beautiful month. Then? October. 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 November. November. And the last one? December. 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 Well, I can see that my students know the months in a very good way. We need to practice a little bit of pronunciation on May and August, right? May and August. Right now, we are on February. February, in some cases, is the favorite month for all the ones that are in love. Oh. February is the top month for the ones that are in love. What is your top favorite month and your least favorite month? I am going to give you my example. My top favorite month is September. And my least favorite month is July. I don't like July. It's very long and it doesn't have vacations. What is your favorite month and the month that you don't like? I need examples. If you want to participate. I mean, like. Okay. Carlos, what is your favorite month? What is your favorite and the one that you don't like? Okay. Um, so yeah. April, no. A April, like or don't like? Don't like, don't like. Don't like. And the one that you like? Uh, Julie, it's Ju my birthday. July. July. July it's my birthday, you say. Birthday. Good. Birthday. Please. <laughs> okay, Elena, go ahead. <laughs> and my, my top favorite month is August. August. But because because it's my birthday uh -huh. and my least favorite month is February. February, why? Uh, I don't like. You don't like February? I don't like. <laughs> okay, that's good. What about Anna? Um, my favorite month is I think December. December. Because it's very happy. Uh -huh. <laughs> I <Yeah>. think <laughs> there are a lot of parties all, uh, all day. All over, all, right? all, 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 <laughs> all uh, over. My, the month that I don't prefer is January. January, why? Because we start to like. Again. Okay, okay, you start <laughs> again. Eduardo, what is the month that you like and the one that you don't like? Yeah. My favorite month is um, November. Why? Because I like 
weather. Oh, you like the weather, good. I like the weather and my last, least, least, pardon, uh, month is um, January. Why? Uh, because I don't have a, a lot of money. <laughs> Yeah, I think everybody. <laughs> That's J in general, right? Very good, very good. Let's see. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, good. Thank you, Eduardo. Thank you, Eduardo. And thank you, Janita, for the message. I already got it. Let's see. We are going to go with Mr. Julio. What is a month that you like and a month that you don't like? Uh, excuse me. Um, my favorite month is February. February, uh huh. Um, and my least favorite. And my least favorite um, December. December. You don't like December. Yes. Um, I don't know. Um, uh, tal vez por. No gasto, no sé. <laughs> yeah, no. you spent a lot of money, right? <laughs> because of the expenses, you say, because of the expenses. Expenses is gastos, right? I am going to send it to you on the chat, on the expenses. Good. Thank you very much. Let me see. I am going to ask the last participant, and it's going to be Cesar. Go ahead. My most favorite is February because in, in my happy birthday. It's your birthday. <laughs> it's your birthday. Uh-huh. It's, it's, it's my birthday. 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 Yeah. Birthday. And mom's uh, least favorite is um, um and June, June, July, July, thank you, July, because is the uh, and my father's. Okay, so we understand, right? You don't like July because of that. Good. So thank you, Cesar, for sharing with everybody. Go out with me, please, January. 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 February. 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 March. 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 April. 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 May. 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 June. 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 July. 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 August. 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 September. 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 October. 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 November. 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 December. 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 Favorite. 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 Don't say favorite, okay? No. Favorite, no. Say favorite. 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 My favorite month. My favorite, My favorite month. month. My favorite month is. My, my least favorite month is. My least favorite month is. Very good. And the last one, birthday. 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 Okay, from now on, please don't say happy birthday to you. No, you say happy birthday to you. Okay. <laughs> Ah, no los quiero cantando de aquí en adelante happy birthday to you no, 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 no no. birthday no, happy birthday to you right, birthday birthday happy birthday happy birthday that's the way it is very happy good birthday. and don't say happy beer day okay, porque beer it's cerveza, right? Don't say happy beer day. Well, depending, right? Yeah, but don't say happy birthday. Happy birthday. Okay? Birthday. Ya podemos ir corrigiendo ahí por el mundo los demás. Decimos, no, 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 no es verde. It's birthday. A 
happy birthday. Okay. Birthday. 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 There you go. Birthday. Happy birthday. Fantastic. Excellent. Excellent. Birthday. Good. Okay. Habíamos vivido engañados. It's not verde. No, it's birthday. Okay. <laughs> Y yo andome por el mundo diciendo verde. No, it's birthday. 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 Very nice. Happy birthday. Now, the best friends for the months are the ordinal numbers. Have you ever seen these type of numbers? These are different from the cardinal numbers because they are used for you to give dates, order, categories, or a specific celebrations right these, these are different from the other ones because you use them to specify dates for example you say first what is the meaning of first primero primero right it's not uno it's primero right second segundo Exactly, segundo. and then you continue, right? Segundo, tercero, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. But in this one, you say first, and you have to make emphasis. You have to make emphasis on the final part of the letter. You say first, right? Second, second, third, third, third. La lengua se le va a ir como para atrás, mm. como que se lo van a tragar. Okay. Say third. 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 You don't say third. third. No, say third. third. La lengua va third. para atrás. Third. 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 Fourth. Third. Aquí cambia. Fourth. Decimos fourth. fourth. Aquí se hace realidad el meme. Right? Fourth. 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 Fifth. Fifth. Six. 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 Seven. Six. Seven. Eight. 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 Tenemos el sonido de la F. And this one is 12th. 13th. 13th. Okay. Okay. For this one, don't say twerting. Okay. Twerting is que no tiene un ojito. 13th. Right? 13th. 14th. 14th. 15th. 15 and in this case, as you see, you have 20, 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th, and then you have 30th. 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 And then you continue with 31st, 32nd, 33rd, 34th, 35th, 36th, 37th, etc., etc. 40th, 50th, 40th. 60th. Now, my question is. Yes, yes. Sorry, sorry, I have a question. Yes. Uh, why uh, the number nine uh -huh. don't have letter E? Okay, that is the in form. The, 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 and the letter 19 has. Yeah, it has the it has the the e the e uh, n t h. This is the form of the ordinal number. Esta es la forma del ordinal en noveno. Yes, I know, but uh -huh. here in 19 we have we have nine. the e. 
Yes, but that is the written form. That is the written form of it. It's very curious. Okay, esa yeah. es la forma escrita de nueve. But because it's very curious, because in well, in Spanish we have noveno. We don't have nueveno. <laughs> it's, yeah. That's that's yeah. like kind of the definition we have in English. But it's curious because this is the form of number nine. You say ninth. Mm -hmm. And okay. 19th, yes, you have it complete. 19. Yeah, yeah it is a very curious question, but it is okay. the form. Okay. That's and the form. That is saying is for nature for 20. 20. Uh, 20. Well, in this case, because you have the transformation of the Y with E. Uh -huh. Okay. 20th. And in this one, because you say 21st, aquí ya uh -huh. no lo cambiamos aquí. Porque aquí el cambio se, se da en las últimas dos letras. Y aquí el cambio cae en la segunda palabra. Okay. Por eso ya no cambiamos 20th. Okay. If not, That's we it. have 20th first. And that will be incorrect. <laughs> yeah. It's a very good question. It's good Thank because you are very observative. That's fantastic. Yes. Yeah. Thanks, teacher. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you for the question. So in this one, it is very curious because the last two letters here, are the last two letters of the word. As you can see here, second, second, third, third. Okay, so please don't do this, for example. Three with TH, no, it is not possible. It's third, right, with RD. And fourth with TH, okay? These last two letters here are the last two letters of the word. Now, I have a very good question. Tell me, when is your birthday? Now that we know the different parts of the months and the dates, I am going to ask you, when is your birthday? And in this case, I have my example. My birthday is on September 15th, right? My birthday is on September 15th. When is your birthday? I am going to put the numbers again for you to say my birthday is July 1st, July 4th, I don't know, August 14th. When my is your birthday? birthday. My, birth, my birthday is April 11th. April 11th. Eduardo? No, Elmer. Oh, Elmer, thank you. April 11th. And now uh, Eduardo has his hand up. Um, my birthday is in September 15th, too. Really? Yay! Hey, congratulations. It's the same birthday. That's so cool. Yes. Hey, nice. Ooh. Somos independientes. <laughs> That's very nice. Jenny, thank go ahead. Uh, my my birthday is on December 21, 21st. 21st, December 21st, almost Christmas. Good, yeah. Wilfredo. Hi, uh, my birthday is November 19th. November 19th, good, next. Who's next? My... Go, Anna, go, go, go. My birthday, my birthday is on November 12th. November 12th. Good, very good. Carlos. My birthday day is July. July. July 6th. July 6th. Six. Six. Very good. Cesar, go ahead. Um, my birthday's birthday. Birthday, my birthday. Birthday, day is um first March. First March. March first. Excuse me, March first. Very good. Another volunteer. Me teacher. Me teacher. Okay, let's go with David and then Heidi. Okay, my birthday is 
January 25th. January 21st. January 21st. Good, good, good. January 21st. First. 21st. Heidi, go ahead. My birthday is in September 9th. My birthday, my birthday. Remember, very good. Birthday, September 9th. Daisy, and then Noemi. My birthday is January 6th. January 6th, Noemi. My birthday is on July 9th. July 9th, good. Todos tienen cuaderno, ¿verdad? Teacher. A ver, yes. todos. Yes. Huh? Elena, tell me. Teacher, uh, uh, repeat again, please. Uh, 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. 30. Yes. Uh, okay. My birthday is August 30th. August 30th. Very good. 30th. August. August, August, with oh, August. Teacher, una pregunta. Yes, Mr. Eduardo. Este, para diferenciar, digamos, uh, 14 de décimo cuarto, porque yo 14, digamos, diría 14. Uh -huh. Y décimo cuarto, 14, con T al final, como usted dice. Uh -huh. Pero tal vez si lo dice los dos juntos, comprendo mejor la pronunciación. Ok. You want to know 40th and 14th. Sí. Ah, 14 y, y décimo cuarto, ¿eh? que es lo, lo que estamos viendo. Ajá, uh -huh, yeah, I know. Ah, uh -huh. uh, now, now I got it, I got it. The normal number and the, and the ordinal. Ajá, uh -huh, sí, porque el normal es 14. 14, and this one is 14th with the uh, sound at the 14th. end. 14th, solo exactly. como el final. Exactly, okay. the okay. change is the TH at the end. So you say 13, 13th. Right, that sound it's going to be the difference, right? Okay, and thank and you, the teacher. use, thank you, thank you. Very good question. Flor de Maria, go ahead. My birthday is June 18th, June 18th, right? Remember the 18th. sound at the end, 18th, 18th. 18th. Okay, don't say it's. it's Es como el, el, la lengüita en medio de los, de los dientes. Sound. It, seems, it, seems. <laughs> right. it, it takes practice. It takes practice. Noemi. Uh, my birthday is on July 9th. July 9th. Right, nice. my birthday. Remember, this is. Hoy vamos a dejar plana de la palabra birthday, birthday, birthday. When you are showering, birthday, 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 birthday. For you not to make the mistake. Right. Good. So, tell me when do you celebrate Valentine's Day? When do you celebrate Valentine's? February, 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 14th, February 14th, February 14th, when, when do you celebrate your special person's birthday, hmm? your uh, wife, your husband, your crush, June 20, 26, June 26, okay, and your mother, when is your mother's birthday, huh? my mother, July 14th. Okay, February. December 13th. December 30th. 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 Good. December 30th. Excellent. Now, with this, right, we were practicing this one. When is your birthday? So you say, my birthday is on September 15th, right? If you want to talk about someone else, so you say, my mother's birthday is on, and you tell me the, the, the specific day. My son's birthday is on, and you tell me the name. Juanita's birthday is on, I don't know Juanita, maybe it's your sister. So for tomorrow, I need you to write five different birth dates of different people in your house, okay? 
para mañana y en el cuaderno vamos a anotar five different birth dates of people in your house. My mother, my father, my brother, my sister, my crush, my wife, my boyfriend. I don't know what you have, but you need to create five, okay? And put the month and the day, okay? But that is going to be for tomorrow. We're going to continue today with a little conversation, right? And, Teacher, yes. Uh, mañana hay clases. Yes, that's something mañana that I want to say. Yeah, it's Friday. It's Friday. I know, I know, I know. Okay, only, only this week we have classes on Friday because we started on Thursday. Eso es importante y eso sí se lo puede decir en español. Esta semana es la única en la que vamos a tener clase el día viernes. ¿Por qué? Porque empezamos hoy, que es día jueves. Y para que les quede cabal el calendario de actividades, solo el día de mañana vamos a tener clase en día viernes, ¿ok? Les prometo que los otros viernes serán libres. Pero la calendarización de inglés corporativo fue jueves, iniciar el curso, y vamos a tener solo el día de mañana clases, ¿ok? Jueves y viernes, para que esa semana puedan tener dos clases y la próxima semana cubramos las cuatro normales, ¿ok? para que podamos terminar el 22 de marzo exactamente. ¿Ok? Chicos, sé que les voy a robar okay, su viernes, teacher. pero va a ser solo una horita, ¿ok? Para que nos demos ahí por, por, por enterados. Thank you very much. Ya se me pasaba. Y mañana yo sola aquí. ¿Y la clase? <laughs> no, but we have class tomorrow. So, the conversation says, happy birthday. And it says, um, Well, do you like your birthday? Yes or no? ¿Le gusta cumplir años? Yes? No? Yes. Yes, yes. right? Yes. Because it yes. is a very special right. day, right? It's right. a very special day. And you feel beautiful and everything because it's your birthday, right? The ladies, we only have birthdays up to 27. De ahí ya no pasamos. De los 27 para allá, no more birthdays, right? Only no more. <laughs> only, only celebration. <laughs> no more numbers. <laughs> so it says, uh, okay, I need you to check the conversation to see if you have new words or new vocabulary. Revisemos la conversación si tenemos palabras nuevas o vocabulario. And you say, teacher, what's the meaning of? And you can tell me there on, on, the, on the image. And if it's clear, tell me no questions. Um, probably. 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 Probably is exactly the same as in Spanish. Probablemente, uh, right? Okay. Probably. Anything. Anything. Algo. Right. Anything. Algo. Good. Any other question? Nin. Which one? Nin. Nin. Uh, it's our own name. Ah, ninth. ninth. It's the number nine. that we have. <laughs> we have just started the numbers. Nin. Go on. Nine. Ninth. 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 August ninth. It's the number. Ninth. This one. Okay. August ninth. Nine. Nine. Good. Very good. Uh, good question. Good question. No, no more questions? Teacher, what is this uh, embarrassing? Ah, okay. Embarrassing. Embarrassing? Embarrassing. I'm going to explain right now. Uh huh. What is the other one? Embarrassing. Okay, embarrassing. 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 But there was another one. Hubo otra, pero no sé cuál fue. Waiters, teacher. Waiters, meseros, waiters. the waiters, the ones that are on the picture right here. Here we have the waiters. Fabulous. 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 Okay, let me see. You say fabulous. Amazing, right? Fabulous. Okay, fabulous is not the, the well, yes, I am disinfectant. Fabulous. And it says, embarrassing, embarrassing, be careful because it's not when you are pregnant, right? It's not that embarrassing. It's like, oh my God, 
Oh no. Oh my God. No. Oh, embarrassing. It's like when you are in a in a pizza restaurant <coughs> of El Salvador, and then you see the people like and you are like <laughs> and you don't know what to do and you are like <laughs> <"Qué pena." laughs> embarrassing <laughs> and then you are like a smile for the picture and everything and you are like <laughs> <"Lo odio." laughs> and it happens that it's embarrassing it's like oh qué pena, right it's like embarazoso but not like pregnant but embarazoso de oh, qué vergonzoso, right? That's the meaning of embarrassing. And it says, are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Are you going to do anything exciting this weekend? Well, I'm going to celebrate my birthday. Fabulous. When is your birthday exactly? It's August 9th, Sunday. So what are your plans? Well, my friend Kayla is going to take me out for dinner. Nice. Is she going to order a cake? Yeah. And the waiters are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. It's so embarrassing. Right? So what is she going to do on the weekend? What is she going to do on the weekend? Uh -huh. he, he is going to celebrate his birthday. She, she is going to celebrate her birthday, right? When is her birthday? Cuando? When is her birthday? August, August 9th. 9th. August 9th, 9th, 9th right? 9th. August 9th. 9th. It's a Sunday, Sunday, right? It's on Sunday. Is she going to eat ice cream? No. No. What is she going to eat? Dinner. She's dinner. going to eat dinner and cake, right? She's going to eat dinner and cake. Good. And what are the waiters going to do? What are the waiters going to do? Sing happy birthday. They are going to sing happy birthday. And you're going to sing happy birthday. They are going to sing happy birthday. Sorry. Has that happened to you? <laughs> Le ha pasado yeah. a ustedes? That yeah. you are in a uh, restaurant and then everybody, <laughs> happy birthday. birthday. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and you it's are so like, hot. it's so yeah. embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> it's embarrassing. I think it's a moment when you don't know what to do. You are just existing like. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know you don't know what to do or what to say or anything right so <laughs> practice with me listen and repeat are you going to do anything exciting this weekend well i'm going to celebrate my birthday well, I'm going to celebrate my birthday. Fabulous. 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 When is your birthday exactly? When is your birthday exactly? It's August 9th, Sunday. It's August 9th, Sunday. Sunday. So, what are your plans? So, so what are your plans? Well, 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 my friend Kayla is going to take me out for dinner. My friend Kayla is going to take me out for dinner. Nice. Nice. Is she going to order a cake? Is she going to order a cake? Yeah. 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 And the waiters yeah. are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. And the waiters are probably going to sing happy birthday to me. It's so embarrassing. It's so embarrassing. 
Okay. What is not embarrassing is to practice English, okay? Algo que no nos tiene que dar pena es hablar inglés, okay? So I am going to send you the conversation on WhatsApp and I need you to practice for tomorrow, okay? Se la voy a enviar a WhatsApp y lo practicamos para mañana. And we're going Excelente. to start with this for Thank tomorrow. You, Have a beautiful night and I'm Thanks, going to see you teacher. tomorrow for next Thank class. Bye. 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 Tomorrow, teacher. Bye. 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 Nice to meet you. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. 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 See you tomorrow. Bye bye, my dear students. See you tomorrow.